Hello and welcome to the Eugene Family YMCA YouTube channel. My name is Bryn and I'm bringing you a chair fitness video today. Please consult your physician before doing any exercise. Make sure that the space around you is safe. And if you ever feel dizzy, short, uh, lightheaded, or have shortness of breath, please stop. Everything you do with me today is at your own risk. Today's class is going to include a warm up, so everything that you do with me is all you're going to need, unless you want to check out some of our other videos. Today we're going to be doing our video in a chair. You're going to need a light set of hand weights. If you don't have, have hand weights at home, you can use some canned goods. Just make sure that they are the same weight, or perhaps water bottles can work really well for that. Make sure you have a water bottle with you. We're going to take a water break, making sure to hydrate our body. Let's get started. So sitting up nice and tall, we're in the center of our chair. We're going to just take a big breath in and blow it out. Just starting to feel your seat underneath you. Big inhale and exhale. This time, inhale, let's take those arms up towards the sky. Reach for the fingers and exhale, hands down. We're going to roll our wrists now. So rolling those wrists around, bringing those arms up. And then reverse those circles, bring your arms all the way back down. Sitting up nice and tall. Inhale, reach those arms up, roll those circles. And reverse those circles, bring it right back down. That feels really good. Lubricating those wrists, checking in with our joints, see how they're feeling today. Make sure that you're doing things at your own pace. Pulling back if you need to. Good, let's shake that out here. Squeeze those hands nice and tight. Spread those fingers wide. Squeeze and spread. Use those small muscles. Spread those fingers. Squeeze and spread. Shake that out. Bring it down. We're going to take the shoulders up to the ears now. And then use your muscles to lower the shoulders down as far as they will go. Inhale, lift and squeeze using your traps. And exhale, lower those shoulders down. Let's do that one more time. Lift and squeeze. And bring it right back down. A couple shoulder circles here. Sitting nice and tall. And again, just check in with those joints. We're getting them warmed up. Good. All righty. Let's go ahead and bring some movement now into our pelvis. You're going to lift one sit bone and walk yourself forward in your chair. And then lift and then walk yourself back. Checking in with that low back. Checking in with the pelvis, the hips. Let's walk ourselves forward. You need to get those arms going here at your sides. And walk yourself back. We're going to sit right there in the back of the chair. Settling in, but nice tall spine. Take your right leg out in front of you. Point and flex through the ankles. Point and flex. Point and flex. Two more times. We're going to take the foot side to side. Side to side. If you can hear the music, you can move to the beat right here with me. How about some circles? Always breathe it in. Blowing it out. Reverse those circles. Get those ankles ready for our class today. Take that foot down, shake it out. Take that left leg out in front of you, and we're gonna go ahead and point and flex. Point and flex. While we're here, tune into that core. Are you sitting tall? Do you have that belly in nice and strong? Let's take that foot from side to side. That feels good. Check it with that ankle. It might feel a little different than the first one. That's okay. Couple circles here. And reverse those circles. Take that foot down, shake it out a little bit. How about those knees? Right leg. We're going to take it all the way out and then bend. Out and bend. Keeping those toes lifted, that ankle is nice and flexed. As you lift the foot, you're going to press the heel away. Starting to warm up that knee joint as well as the quadriceps. How about four more? And three, two, last one. Let's go left leg. Take it out and in, out and in. Toes are lifted, pressing through the heel. Starting to warm up that left knee. Nice and strong in those quads. Good, take it down, shake that out. Walk yourself forward. Coming into this nice upright position, we're gonna march it out. Start with that right foot, we're gonna march it. Starting to get that blood pumping here. 
Notice that I've got my arms moving. You can join me. Keep those hands in a soft fix. We don't need to clench anything here. We don't need to build tension. We want to build strength for our heart, for our lungs, for our muscles. Good. Couple more here. Still just getting adjusted. Getting that heart rate up. You'll start to feel a little bit warmer here. Eight, seven, six. We're gonna start with some heel taps out in front. Let's go left and right. Left and right. So just getting used to this lower body here at first. If you wanna to start to add upper body in, you can start to press your arm in front. So you get a same side arm, same side leg. In my classes, I like to add a little bit of brain work, so you can expect that in our video today. And if you get it right, great. If you don't, that's okay, no big deal. Four, three. Take your arm to the sky, take it up. So check in with those shoulders. If this feels okay, continue here. If you need to bring your arm back down in front, you can do this, okay? So do what feels best. We're gonna take the arm to the side now. Take it out and out. Reaching through those fingers, readjust that posture, nice and tall. Eight more here. All right, so we're gonna add both arms now back to the front. Here we go, chest press push, push. Still digging those heels, still with that nice tall spine. Last eight, breathe. You got it, four, three, both arms to the sky, right here, press it up, up, up. How's that core doing? Belly in nice and strong, good. Seven, six, four, three, we're gonna take it to the side, press it up. You getting warmer? I am. Stay right here with me for just a few more. We've got eight and seven. Six, four, three, two, release that. Shake it all out, roll those shoulders. All right, I want you to bring those feet right here in front of you. Ankles, knees, hips all in line. We're gonna start to tap those toes. Starting to warm up that anterior tibialis. Belly is in nice and strong. Give me your arms at your sides. Palms facing inward, adding a bicep curl. Here we go, take it up and down. Now, you can notice that my palms are facing my hips when they're down. My palms are facing my shoulders when they're up. So we've got a little rotation here. Try it out, see if it works for you. If it doesn't, that's okay. We're moving, we're just grateful to be here together. Pull, release, pull. Those shins start to feel it, my arms. Last two. We're gonna add on bigger arms. Here we go. We're gonna go up and up and down and down. Good, lift and reach. Down and down. Beautiful. We've got one more just like this. We're gonna zigzag those toes. Keep those arms. We're up and up and down and down. So this is where it gets tricky with that brain work, okay? So if you're not doing it perfectly, if it feels weird and awkward, you're actually doing it right. You're challenging yourself. We're gonna do four more just like that. Arms up and up and down and down. Three more. You're doing great. Two. Here's your last one. Reach. We get to shake that out. Ooh. All right, all right. We're gonna take that left foot. We're gonna come into a mambo step. So you're gonna step forward and back, forward and back. So you can just move the lower body. You can get those arms right here at your sides. If you want a little bit bigger range, you can start to lean forward, pull back. Lean and pull. So use the strength of your core to move your torso towards me and then away from me. You can add bigger arms with a reach and a pull. Reach and a pull. Reach. Keep going right here. We've got eight. Seven. Six. Now for the last four, do some fun, funky arms. Whatever you want to. You've got two more. Change it up. Woo! Last one, last one. 
last one. Let's march it left, left. Sitting up nice and tall. We're gonna start to walk, march it wide. Good, now bring that right back in. We're gonna do single leg, left and right, left and right. So notice that my knees are bent. Hey, I'm still sitting tall. We're just testing the water. Tap, tap, tap. Good. Arms can be right here, or you can come into some bigger arms. You're gonna reach, reach. So take those fingers up to the corners, one arm at a time. If you're ready, the shoulders feel healthy, you've gotta go bigger, you know you've gotta go bigger. Both arms here, we go. Take it out and up. Breathing in the nose and out the mouth. That's it, we got eight, seven, six. Last four, three, two, beautiful job. March it right here. Ooh, big breaths. Go that out. All right, last four, three. Let's plant those feet once more. Right in line with hips and ankles. Start to tap those heels. A little bit different as we come into our second side. We're gonna bring those arms up to goal pose here. Give those shoulder blades a squeeze. Give that belly a squeeze in. Arms go front and back, forward and back. Woo, right on that music change, love it. So we're gonna really hug through the chest when the arms come out in front. We're gonna hug through the shoulder blades when the arms go back. Beautiful, keep tapping those heels. You're gonna feel it in your calves now in that lower body, balancing out the muscles in that lower leg. Beautiful. All right, we're gonna go with some bigger arms. Here we go, we're gonna go forward and back. Now up and down, that's it. Forward and back and up and down. Now again, if those shoulders say, hey, you know what, I wanna just hang out low today. You can do that, watch me, you can just stay right here. Just like we did before, right? Stay here. If you know you've gotta go bigger, We've got those arms going up to the sky. Reach. One more. Let's keep those arms zigzag, those heels. So, it might take you a little while, woo, to catch that, just like it did for me. No problem. Oh, again, again. Forward and back and up and down. Good, we've got four more right here. Tune into that core. Keep it strong. Zigzag those heels. You can do this. Good brain work. You know, this is our last one. Woo! Nicely done. Shake it out. We're going to march it on that right foot. Find that beat. Sit up nice and tall. Four, three, mongo right foot. Let's take it forward and back. Remember, you can just stay upright. Keep those arms at your sides here. If you want to go a little bigger, you can lean your body forward and back. Use your core to lead and guide you. You can add that bigger arm, left arm reaches and pulls. Reach and pull. Smile, you're having fun. You got it. We've got eight more. Reach and pull. Keep that mama step. All right, four more. Do those fun, funky arms, whatever you want. Last two. Woo, shake that out. March it, march it. All right, we're gonna go ahead and come into just a small little jack series. We're gonna start maybe with just the upper body, okay? So arms are gonna go up to the corners. We've got four. Three, good, feet on me. Four, three, just tap it out. Back to the arms. Four, three, two, and the feet. Four, three, let's do that all together. Here we go, let's go up. Up, belly in nice and strong. How about the right side only, arm and leg? That's it, remember that toe, we're just tapping the water. Just a little tap out. How about that left side? Pull 
out of the whole body. Eight more. Good. Last four. Three, two, all done. And release. Sit up nice and tall. Woo. We got our warm up. We've got our cardio. We're going to take a big breath in. Blow it out. Just bring that heart rate down just a little bit. One more time. Inhale up. And exhale. Good. So go ahead and grab that water bottle, get a quick drink. Super important to hydrate when you're exercising. We're going to reach under our chair and grab those, those hand weights. Now I've got a light set for me today. But as you continue to do this video with me, if you want to bump up those weights as we go, feel free to. We're going to take it back in our chair, palms facing inward, belly is in, coming into biceps curls, take a deep breath, then exhale, we're going to turn the palms up to the shoulders, inhale, lower down. So bring those upper arms right next to your rib cage, lift and squeeze, inhale, lower, exhale, inhale. Good. We've got three more right here, getting those biceps nice and strong, two, Last one. Keep those arms right at your side. We're going to start with the right arm for some front raises. Thumb is up. Take a deep inhale. Exhale. Take that right arm out in front, about shoulder height. Inhale, lower. And then exhale, left. So using that breath to guide the way. Exhale, right. Inhale, lower. Exhale, left. Inhale, lower. Really important to keep a slight bend in your elbow. Okay? Protect that joint. And you're using nice control movement here. You're not swinging or building momentum. You're using your strength. Take a soft grip on that weight. Make sure that you're not overstressing the hand, the joints. Good. Two more times. Both sides here. And last one. And left to finish. Give those shoulders a roll out. We're going to go ahead and take one weight underneath now. Swing your body over towards the left side of your chair. Bring your weight into your right hand. We're going to sit up nice and tall. Bring that elbow back behind you. And then we're going to inhale lower back down. Exhale as you lift and inhale lower. So keeping your head going straight forward. We're going to just let that hand come and graze your hip. Working on the back of that shoulder. Your posterior deltoid. We got four more of those. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Two more. We're going to go straight to our triceps here. Okay. We're going to lift that elbow up. Hold it in place. It's not going to go anywhere. Take a big breath in. Exhale. We're going to reach that arm back. Bend the elbow hand to your hip. Exhale. Reach back. Bend the elbow hand to your hip. So keeping that tricep working. Keeping that elbow steady. Good. Reaching it back. Hand to the hip. Nice and tall in your chest. And two. Last one for this side. Woo! Place that hand on your thigh. Get that shoulder roll out. Swing those legs around to the other side. You're going to switch the weight into your other hand. Sitting up nice and tall. We'll start with that posterior deltoid. We're going to lift the elbow back. Hand your hip. And lower back down. Lift and lower. Lift. So now notice my posture is nice and tall. I really want to isolate the back of that shoulder here. Using my muscles to lift that weight. We're going to do two more here. Good. You feel it? I do. We're going to go right to those triceps now. Lift that elbow deep in now. And then exhale, extend the arm back. Keep the elbow there, bend, and exhale, reach. Good. Now I'm looking at you, but you should be looking straight forward, keeping that neck nice and line. I'll do that too. Inhaling and exhale. Feel that power. Inhale and exhale. Two more here. Last one. And Good. Let's place that hand on that thigh. Roll those shoulders out. Bring those body right back to center. And take the weight underneath your chair. 
sitting up nice and tall. Great job today. Let's stretch it out a little bit. We'll start with that right arm. Just bring it across to you. Left hand's going to hug it in. If you want to get an extra stretch for your shoulder, you can just turn your head gently to the right. Big breaths here. Really important to take time to stretch after workout. Give those muscles lots of love. Help them rebuild, get them ready for the next time you want to use them. We're going to bring the head back to center, the arm to center. We'll stretch that tricep. So use your left hand, press that elbow up and down. If you have a bigger range, you can bring the arm up high. Make sure your core is in nice and strong here. Take another big breath. Exhale out. Let's bring that arm down. Shake that out. Bring the left arm across the body now. Give it a hug in. It's time to cool down. Just bring that breath in and out nice and full. Turn your head to the left. We'll bring that head to center and press that elbow up and down. And again, you can support by holding nice and low. If that right shoulder feels like it wants to go bigger, then bring it up nice and tall. Remember to keep that belly in nice and strong here. Right, and release that arm. Roll the shoulders out. We're going to bring the hands right here together, clasping. Press those knuckles forward. Tuck the chin and round your spine back. A little tuck of the tailbone. Big breath into your upper back, between the shoulder blades. Exhale all the way. Gently release. Scoot yourself forward in your chair, clasping on the back rest. Roll those shoulders back and just lean your torso forward. Really nice, beautiful stretch for your collarbone, the chest. Realign your neck. So lift your crown, chin towards the chest. Big breath in. And blow it out. Let's come on up. Just Tiny bit more for that lower body to stretch it out. Take that right leg out front. You might need to scooch forward in your chair. Lift those toes up. Hands on the left thigh. We're going to hinge from our hips. We're going to just draw your torso forward over that left knee. Lifting through those right toes. That's going to stretch that hamstring a little bit more. Big breath in. And exhale. Great job. Go ahead and point those right toes away. Stretch through that shin. And we'll bring it right back up. Take that left leg out, front heel down, toes lifted, hands on that right thigh. Big breath here. Exhale as you hinge forward. Keep those left toes lifted. Feel that stretch? It's nice. Deep inhale. Exhale all the way. Good. So we bring it on up. We'll go ahead and bring it in. Walk it back just a little bit. Toe heel those feet out nice and wide for me. And we'll bring it in. So we're going to start to stretch those hips. Keep that range of motion in those ankles. Feeling real good here today. And we'll bring it right back in. Let's do that one more time together. And bring it right back in. Sitting up nice and tall. Three big breaths to finish. Inhale, reach your arms up and up. And exhale, release. You did such a great job today. Don't you feel better? So strong. Inhale, up. And exhale. Last big breath today. Inhale all the way up. And exhale, release. Great job. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of me. Come back and join me anytime you need to. Have a wonderful day.